Let's learn more. Let's learn more. Let's learn more with liberty. The word liberty. It is an important word and concept. You might even say it is a foundational word for our country. You see, the liberty we enjoy today took over 300 years to develop. It started after the patriots, now turned Americans, established the original 13 states, laying the foundation for the United States of America. The newly independent America was founded upon the idea that all men are created equal that all people have the right to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Americans now also had the liberty to self-govern. But after the American Revolution, the questions became, how can the founders create a government that upholds and defends these ideas? And how do they create a government that works? The Founding Fathers thought the previously established Articles of Confederation would provide government stability. But they were wrong. The Articles of Confederation were in fact weak. The government couldn't collect taxes. It struggled to pass laws. It couldn't pay back money from the war or maintain a military. And it had difficulty creating policies toward other countries. America's founders included George Washington, James Madison, and Alexander Hamilton were fearful for the future of the new nation. So, gathering in Independence Hall, delegates from each state, except Rhode Island, assembled to discuss ways to fix the Articles. After significant deliberation in mid-June of 1787, the delegates made a decision. They would abandon the Articles of Confederation rather than revise them. And a new set of rights and laws would be written, laying the foundation for the United States Constitution. Let's talk more about how the idea of liberty was protected through this important document and the people and events that helped shape the writing and adoption of it. <laughs> 